Evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Patrice Dayton and I'm Ron Jerome Moore. Last year, the officer down memorial page reported a total of nine line of duty deaths in Illinois. Five of those officers died by gunfire. One of those officers was Chris Oberheim. He worked for the Champaign, Illinois Police Department. He died in May after responding to a domestic disturbance call. Now his widow and several other officers are supporting new legislation that can help bring justice to others like him. It can also provide support to current uniformed officers. Illinois State Senator Darren Bailey is filing House Bill 3899. Now under this bill, the death penalty would be reinstated to those found guilty of killing a cop. News 10's Caitlin Hunt attended Senator Bailey's press conference today. She joins us live in the newsroom with more. Patrice Rondrell, Senator Bailey said today that Senate Bill 3899 is a needed step to show law enforcement that they have support. And he's also hoping that it'll bring justice to the families of fallen officers. Illinois State Senator Darren Bailey is proposing the reinstatement of the death penalty for killing police officers. This would reverse the 2011 abolishment of the death penalty. But Senator Bailey believes this is a needed change. He says Illinois sees a lack of law and order, and this legislation would help the state see it once again. What we can do is stand up and make sure that it is known far and wide that in Illinois, if you commit a crime of murdering a police officer in the line of duty, your violent actions will be answered with the full weight of capital punishment in our judicial system. Senator Bailey also has the support of several local law enforcement, including Jason McFarland, Effingham's chief of police. He says this bill would provide closure for fallen officers and their families. There must be some kind of mechanism or punishment that can match. I guess it'll never match the loss felt by the family, but there must be something more than just imprisonment. One of those families is Amber Oberheim. Her husband is a fallen Champaign officer. For her, Senate Bill 3899 should be a nonpartisan issue. Trust me. My husband's killer did not stop and ask him if he was a Democrat or Republican before he shot him three times. It doesn't matter what side of the line you sit on. Bullets are flying in the streets of Illinois, and they don't differentiate between political parties. Senator Bailey also said this could be the first of many bills that show support for law enforcement. If this legislation is passed, it would go into effect on the first of next year. Reporting live in the newsroom, Caitlin Hunt, News 10.